Alright everyone, game for you back, and now we're going to go on a covert operation with one of the wonderful people from the original trilogy. Thanks for the assistance, Jaden. Luke tells me you're going to be a great Jedi. Let's get to Krildor and take out that mining platform. Looks just like him, doesn't it? What did I do to you, Wedge? He even had the angry face. <laughs> what did they do to you? Let's go protect... No, wait. Where do we want... I prefer grip over drain. Drain is quite useful though. Grip is quite useful though. The only problem with grip is you can only get one person at a time. Drain you can like take out a whole squad of stormtroopers and give you life. Yeah. Also, I think um, the original voice actor for Wedge voice acted for Rogue Squadron 2. Really? Yeah. I'm not sure about 3 though. If it was live action, how is he a voice actor? What? So if it's, if um, Star Wars is live action, how is he a voice actor? You said the original voice actor of this facility oh, is lightly defended. Original actor. I don't think they expected us to find it. For the game. My targeting computer will lock onto your. You beacons. know what I mean. Place I know. them on key structural points, then get out of there fast. I'll be flying in, lasers blazing. If everything goes as planned, we'll have the defenses down before they know what hit them. So is why is it only wedge and no other? Okay, Jaden. I don't know. Start with the shield generator. Was he flying Otherwise, a Z ninety five? Why was he flying a Z ninety five? I don't know. Maybe it's more stealthy. So, he could always lock the S-foils, it's about the same thing. Oh, I think I that box guy. killed him. That box definitely killed him. This is actually one of my favorite levels in the game. Oh, okay, that's cool. I need to get upstairs. <laughs> the best weapon that a, sh a stormtrooper can use is a shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> What's that, a security cam? Security turret. I just realized they don't really affect me because I can put it into fast defensive mode and electrocute them. Which one do you prefer, fast or strong? Fast is uh, more convenient most of the time, just because you don't have to worry about, um... Strong is a really slow over top of the head swing. Fast, as you can tell, is like... Yeah. Fast. Ballerina. Yeah. Okay, so there aren't any more of those things. Oh, now we're gonna get to the cool guys. The problem with them is the fact that you have to wait for them to come in close, and then you can maybe get a hit on them. Well, why don't you use force pull? Doesn't work too well, surprisingly, with them. Force grip? Also, it doesn't work very well unless you have it all the way up, and I'd rather drain the life out of them. Move it, Jaden. I'm coming in. He is driving X-Wing, thank goodness. Put a beacon in the hangar, so they can't scramble air support. There's your proton torpedo for you. That's like walk over. Pull up. The way he maneuvers around the uh, place, like through all the buildings and everything, is like amazing. Head for the garrison. That yeah, he's very close to the buildings. It does make it more difficult for them to hit him, though. Crap. Sometimes if you go and push the button like that, this the is jump, too easy. it'll, like, flip you off and everything. <laughs> wow. Did you see that shot? Next, take out the yeah. communications array, so they can't signal for help. Wouldn't that be significant to take out that first? Well, shield generator has to go down first, so they can't. I mean, so oh, you can, you know. You can hit it, but. You know. Good point. Everything's broken now. It's all brokeity broke. <gasps> Ow. Hey, you're there. Yeah, you're there. 
Hey, you there with the lightsaber, yeah. Could you put that down, please? Did you see just casually walking out? Ugh! He's just gonna hit the jump. Actually, that one back there, the building that the guys are coming out of? Yeah. That one is hilarious if you do it um, just right because there's a uh, dark Jedi up there. And if you hit it just right, you can blow him up. You can blow him up, and it'll like slow motion bomb the place. Cool. Now this elevator right here is where you're supposed to go, but it doesn't work until after. Murder everything? After you've gone and blown up the uh, communications relay. Oh. Linearity convenience? What? I said linearity for the win. Yeah. <laughs> it makes it so much easier. Fear my baggy pants. Fear my pantaloons. Fear that they're more fashionable than yours. Your garb. Ha <laughs> ha Oh, check this out. Oh yeah, rocket launcher? Portable missile system. My little tiny, um, didn't do it. Oh, check this out. Now you can actually let it stay out there and control where it goes. Did you upgrade it? No, it um, does automatically after the uh, final stage of stage thing or whatever you want to call them. Okay, so your basic force powers upgrade. They upgrade over time. You can't upgrade them yourself. Cool. Is it? There it is. Making another run. He might get blown up in this. Yeah. <gasps> Add the next beacon on the power to it, so we can disable those turbo lasers. <laughs> well, we just saw a gun fade from existence. Yeah. So I gotta get down there. I wonder if it's in the twilight zone now. <laughs> that would be pretty awesome if it was. Oh, look, it's a dark Jedi. It's a Jedi. <laughs> Is that a way to greet another Jedi? <laughs> Just. Nyeh. <laughs> Nyeh. I probably could have just. Hit him with lightning one more time and made him fall in there and killed him. Also, if you fall down there, you die. Oh, wonderful. He doesn't notice a thing. That's a set of power makes everything so much cheaper in this game. <coughs> I didn't know currency was a part of this game. What do you think I use to get my force points? Oh, I see. I thought Republic credits weren't good. I thought your I need real money, not Republic You're doing credits. Great, I thought your dealer was a Tidarian. You just like the random shots coming from the back corners and everything down there. One more left. Also, whose bright idea get was to the it? command center next, Jaden. That's the last target. Whose bright idea was it to not um, have lasers that could shoot down here? Because, I mean, you could easily come up from the bottom and get everything. Yep. Well, you have to appreciate this Imperial t architecture. Dead. The fact they didn't take off is amazing to me. They normally take off and you can't hit them. <gasps> oh, 
Okay, now for the command center. Command center? They've captured a command post! I used to actually when I was little try to jump across that gap right there. <laughs> the problem was I got over the gap, it's just I kept going. It was like Obi-Wan using force speed. Yeah, I finally showed him that. <coughs> yeah, that was a good video, but I'm not even kidding, it really was. And I go and just go flying. I'm like, oh man. I think that video was made in the early heyday, around 2006. You hear something? Stop! There we go. Slow motion. <laughs> Troops are making their way to the storage tanks to sabotage them. Stop them, or this mission will be for nothing. Roger that, General. <laughs> oh, he's a general now. Wait, if he's a general, then why is he help? Why is he doing this? Why didn't he get someone else to do it? Actually, here in this Star Wars essential chronologically. Hold on one second. I think he was promoted to be commander. Oh my God! Look what survived. Well, those things are tough buggers. Yeah, I blow. I just blow it up. Let me see where I can. Where can I find him? Hold on. Take your time. Vaporizing stormtroopers. Yeah. <gasps> that guy looks very confused. What happened to his friends? Hold on. I almost crotch shot at a stormtrooper. You ready for this? That's terrible. Uh, yes, it is. I'm a terrible person. Just because I'm a Jedi. Oh man, it even covers the World Devastators. Awesome. The Resurrection of Emperor Palpatine, yes. I actually have the audio book for it. Really? They made yeah. an audiobook of it? Yeah, it was a Dark Horse comic. Hmm. Actually, I finished up the Communist Manifesto the other day when I was reading after I got home from work. Yeah? I actually have two Star Wars graphic novels I have from like when I was actually little, I bought those and read them. Really? I'm thinking of actually going back and rereading them. Wait, what are they? Two Star Wars novels from like 2005. Commander Wedge Intilities. Can they find them? Yep. That's one bomb down. This I did you, you just missed it. I killed the guy. Oh, I didn't kill him. I shot him with lightning and he went flying back, and the whole time he was flying backwards, he kept shooting me. <laughs> what? He was pulling flying... a matrix? Yeah. Up oh, there it goes again. Ah <coughs> uh, yes. This really was probably like my favorite to level growing up on this yeah. game. Doing great, Jaden. How many more, Witch? How many more? One more, okay. I say, since I went and sniped those guys, it's kind of not exactly exciting anymore. Yeah. That's why I get there for trying to get be efficient. Ship, We're out of here. Speaking of sniping. Oh, 
Oh, I'm out of ammo, my sniper rifle. I guess he would be committed to the rank of general. I don't know. Everybody in the Star Wars universe is easily committed to the rank of general. Yeah. Except for Admiral Akbar. He never became General Akbar, did he? I don't think so. See, why is it random people like Wedge get it, but Ak Admiral Akbar says Admiral? Yeah, and I don't get how Thrawn was that Admiral, since he was clearly a significant villain. Maybe he just got in the line and said, hey, who wants to be a, Repub I mean, a, rebel a rebellion general? It seems like the more significant people military rise are admirals instead of generals. I don't know, every Je Jedi Master in the Khan's council was appointed a general. Yeah. Automatically. It's like honorary generals. Yeah, really. I think Padawans are considered colonels. Really? Yeah, anything that was any form Great of um, force wielding right person. Was considered is higher than a clone the trooper. <laughs> Thanks to you, the remnant isn't going to be supplying the disciples of Ragnos anytime soon. Yay! Jaden, I learned that some disciples of Ragnos were on Dagobah. They siphoned the dark force energy from the cave there. <laughs> this is sad. We find that so amusing. Okay. Well, thanks for watching, guys. We'll see y'all next time. So yeah, thanks for watching.